Hi everyone, John Paul Brionis here from InMotion Hosting, and thank you for joining us for another video in our Getting Started series. Today I'm going to show you how to request a website transfer in AMP. Start by logging into your account management panel, also known as AMP. Keep in mind your username is your email address. Once you've logged into cPanel, scroll down to the section for your hosting plan and you'll see a website transfer request button here. Go ahead and click that. When you do, you'll see this website transfer request step one page. In the transfer to hosting account, choose the domain that you want to transfer. Select your old host from the drop down list. If you don't see it listed here, select other. I'm just going to select other for my test here. And I'm just going to put this as just a test. And then for the host name, you should enter your IP address or the website name for your account. Enter your old username or the username from your previous hosting account. And once again, I'm just making this up. Make sure you're using the correct information for your old account. And you may want to test it, your password and everything, before giving it to us, just to be sure. Enter the number of databases you have and the number of websites you have. I'm just going to do two and two. And then you can add additional information or a note here in the bottom. I'm going to put this as a test just so that uh, that way the tech support will know that I'm just performing a test. I don't actually want to transfer this website. All right. Once you've made your selection, the last choice is to choose if you want a priority website transfer or not. If you have a priority website transfer, there is a charge, but it will push your transfer to the top of the queue. Otherwise, if you say no thanks, it will be transferred in the order received of your uh, the order your request was received. Go ahead and click continue once you filled in the fields. You'll then see the website transfer request step two page and essentially just confirm all the information is correct again. You will see a price quote if there's any price uh, involved in the transfer. At this point, you can add a new card or you can choose an existing card from your account if you already have a uh, credit card in your account. Once you've filled in the information, um, you can agree to the charge and submit your website transfer request. If you don't agree, then we will actually contact you to confirm the price before we proceed with the migration. Once you've chosen, click the Submit Website Request button. And this will create a ticket for us to complete the request. In my test, it's telling me you know, I need to enter a valid credit card. But when you enter one, it will actually proceed and create the ticket at that time. Thank you for joining us for another video in our Getting Started series. Feel free to like this video and comment below so we can bring you more great videos in the future. Do you know the InMotion Hosting Support Center has thousands of articles, pictures, and video tutorials to help you out with your web hosting questions? Something for everyone, from beginners to experts. Join our community and sign up with your Facebook or Google Plus for free swag, prizes, and discounts. Visit our support center at InMotionHosting.com support.